Tiny headbands. She gon' shake it for them blue hunters. Take her home, she gon' do some. Chick, chick, chick. She gon' shake it for them blue hunters. What's up, okay, gang? Kiraka family, I am back with another video. Today, video, I'm going to be answering some questions that you guys have asked me as well as taking out my braids because they need to be gone. Got to be gone. <laughs> Don't forget to follow all my social media. So be in the description box down below. Don't forget to comment that care gang. See you in my next video. Today's video shot with these people right here. So if you don't want to be a shot in my next video, don't forget to comment that care gang. So let's get into the video. That way. Okay, so I low-key already started last night. This one I actually took out it was from the back part of my hair and then these were slipping out like imagine if I got into a fight and they just started coming off like it was just that, it was just that time. Okay, so we're gonna take out this headband. Y'all see this, like. Right, look at the back. The treachery. So you guys asked a total of 86 questions, which is like quite a lot, but a lot of them were like repeated, like, you know, like they were like double questions, if that makes sense. So that's a go. What's up, girl? She said, who's your best friend? I mean, I think we already know at this point, you know, my best friend is Cynthia. We've been friends since like kindergarten. So yeah, life is pretty great. And Jessica and Zanaya always be making fun of me just because we're best friends, but they're best friends too, so. Um, how old are you? I'm 15 years young. Um, how's school? School's pretty great, but then again, I don't really like light school. It's just like my friends that make school so lit. Like, if my friends were here, I don't know what I'll be doing. Look at that. It just slips right off. Like, this is going to be a breeze. What's your favorite color? My favorite color is maroon, olive green, and white. Those are my three favorite colors. Not to cut too much off, like, probably like right here. I know my hair ain't this long. These scissors are like so trash, like oh my gosh. small youtubers a tip i would say for small youtubers is when you're starting off don't think like your first couple videos will blow up and i only have two subscribers and this video only got like 10 views like that's how i was like it takes time it takes time and patience and just keep perfecting your craft with each and every video just you know do something different maybe whether that be with editing whether that be with your setup whether that be with whatever it is you know because the thing is about youtube is just like you never know you know so don't think just because this person is doing so good and you know you have to go down and look at their videos when they started off unless they bought their subscribers so that's the tea <laughs> Who are your church friends from Kiki? Kiki, you already know. You already know the gang. <laughs> Let me stop. Okay, two, what inspires you to start a YouTube channel? Um, what inspired me to start a YouTube channel? I was always bored and I always talked to myself. Like, ask anybody. Even at school, I talked to myself. Like, I always talked to myself. How much do you weigh? I'm 5'6", and I think I weigh like 110, 117, around there. No, 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 no. I weigh 113, yeah. I'm 5'6 and I weigh 113, so. Ain't no, ain't no booty yet, but you know, we getting there.
like being a YouTuber? Yes and no. I do like being a YouTuber in the sense of creating my own content for people, being able to be myself, being able to do something, you know what I'm saying? While in high school and just having time that occupies myself, but it can be stressful. Like, you will get kind of like writer's block. Like, you don't know what to create, you don't know what to do. Like, you, you will have these moments where you just freak out because you don't know what to do on YouTube. And that happened to me like a lot, like especially last year. Oof, your girl was a little inconsistent. <laughs> when is your birthday? My birthday is May 10th. And I'm a Taurus. If you did not know, the best zodiac sign ever. Like, I mean, can you deny? We just pop in like that. What's your for face routine? Um, for my face routine, at the moment, I haven't been doing a lot. So this is my face routine, because they're all right here. I like to use this mask, C. Freeman, apple cider, vinegar, clay mask. I used to like to use this because it dries out. Like, let's say you have a bump, it'll dry it out. You know what I'm saying? So I like to use that. And then for my face, I like just to use my Noxzema Deep Cleanser. I like that. And the next thing I like to have is my Dove Cream, my Intensive Cream. I really like it. And that's what I've been using as of recently. I haven't been really doing too much. Are you in college or high school? I'm a freshman in college. Um, I go to Spelman University. <laughs> I'm just playing. I'm in high school and I'm a sophomore. Class of 2022, stand up. Ah! Favorite show, TV show slash movie. My favorite TV show at the moment um, is The Good Doctor. I also like watching The Flash. I like watching All American. Whew, those are like my favorite TV shows, but most likely if I had to choose one, it will be The Good Doctor. Because like, your girl just love watching stuff like that. What is, what is it that you like most about Canada? I like their weather. Like, it was summer, and it was like 70 something degrees. Like, I was like, this is like the perfect weather. And I like the people there, and like, the sidewalks are never empty. There's always like, people walking. Food tastes so different. The food tastes so different, like healthy food. And you come in America, everything is just like so greasy. And over there, everything is just so like, I don't know how to really explain it, but yeah. You plan on doing YouTube as a job or whole life? P.S. I love you. I love you too, sis. Like, what you do? Um, I plan on doing YouTube for as long as YouTube lasts, if that makes sense. Um, but I don't plan on it being my like a full-time job of mine I plan on it being like kind of like a side hustle because I still want to have a job besides YouTube if that makes sense because you never know how long YouTube gonna be here for you know you never know and YouTube is so inconsistent you never know one day you might make banks and one day you might be struggling <laughs> do you have any brothers or sisters I have three other sisters um, so yeah, they're like so annoying sometimes, but it's okay. Um, I like some of my sisters, some of my brothers. <laughs> my sister look at me like, you don't even have a brother. Yeah, I don't have any brothers, but I only have sisters, sadly. Do you get recognized in public and how do your family, friends, and school feel about your YouTube channel? So. Do I get recognized in public? Yes, most likely at school. But like, oh my god, girl, I like that YouTube channel. Like, you be doing this and that. And at first, it used to freak me out. Like, I'm like, oh my gosh, they see me do this. I just think of all the things I did in my videos that people are just watching, you know? That I'm like, ugh, that's weird. I do get recognized for the most part. I'm not used to it, but I'm not like how I used to freak out about it as much. It's like, yo, that's kind of cool. That's kind of lit. That's kind of lit, man. And my friend and family, I mean, I'm not going to say that they could care less because obviously they do care on what I do and stuff. But it's just like, like my friends especially, I thought like if I told my friends this stuff, they'll act a certain way. But they honestly don't care. They still pick on me. <laughs> like, you know, like when you just be picking on your friends, they still like act the same way. So I haven't really felt like... They act a certain way. I mean, I don't really know for the most part. I never ask people, how do you feel about me being, you know, this and that? 
nobody really has even said like oh i feel so weird or this and that some people be like oh my gosh you're famous i'm just like not yet you know how do you feel about veganism and would you ever go vegan or vegetarian well right now i'm trying the pescatarian trying because your girl kind of cheated a couple times so as of next year like 2020 i really want to like go full blown pescatarian but right now i'm trying like i don't really eat meat like that like mm. i feel like going vegan and trying veganism is great because you're helping yourself you're helping your body obviously i don't really know how to explain it but the reason that i am trying or going pescatarian is because i just wanted to do the best for myself and yeah so far i like it like i felt more energized i feel more energized i don't feel as groggy as i used to like i really noticed a difference which is what i want so yeah it's pretty cool your girls like have a different like look on life i guess like <laughs> what's your type what qualities do you look for in a boyfriend Alright you guys, so that's the new video. If you guys enjoyed it. So don't forget to follow all my social medias as well as my TikTok. Your girl got a TikTok. Who am I? Now I'm about to say bye for Star Week and I'll freak with the occasion. Get your iPad. Get your way. So we got enjoy my verse. Peace. You girls out. Hey. 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 I learned on TikTok the little the seatbelt. It's like mm, 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 Let me stop. I like a hot mess. Like what ill does? I'm a poppin'. Let me remind you. Okay, this is.